I'd like to read my poem. I've entitled it Palm Sunday Triumph. And it is from the story of Palm Sunday and the events preceding it. It's told in the Gospels, and it's, it's from the Gospels. Too. Tell that oh so human story of when he wept and groaned and bared his soul to one he loved. She held him in her arms and anointed his feet and rubbed his hair with honeysuckle oil, so sweet and rich that the nectar of fragrant flowers filled her home in Bethany. And of how he didn't want to go, but go he would, and go he did into the holy city. There Hosanna praise rose on the city streets, and he could not deny the day or his calling or who he was. And yes, despite the danger, even though they pursued him, he would not hide nor cower. He would not slink nor shrink the cloak of glory that had come to him. Stony hearts turned to fire, volcanic power erupted from human souls who called out in praise and a voice of thunder filled the sky in praise of him who graced the people on that day. Head high, eyes beaming, heart radiating the highest love, voice declaring, mouth proclaiming, shining a brilliant light from above. What bittersweet victory, the best the world could offer. Yet no more noble man has walked the earth than he who passed by that triumphant day through the streets of Jerusalem on that first Palm Sunday morning.